I want to especially welcome you to this afternoon's moment of prayers. And it's my prayer that our time together will be meaningful. Our prayers will be answered. I need to receive divine touch in Jesus' name. I will worship you forever. Love you forever because God is too much and I will worship you forever love you forever because this God is too much oh yes I Psalm chapter 50 verse 15 he said call upon me in the day of trouble and I will deliver you and you shall glorify me but to the wicked God says what right have you to declare my status or take my covenant in your mouth we will call on the name of the Lord in the time of trouble you will agree with me that the nation Nigeria is in a time of trouble no doubt about that things are not going fine there are killings everywhere the economy is not doing fine people are getting kidnapped and missing this is the time to cry out unto God this is the time to cry for his help he said call unto me in the days of trouble and I will deliver you this is the time to cry out unto God and in this few moments I would like us to reach out to the thrones of heaven First of all, I want us to give him thanks for making us a part of this nation. Let us give him thanks for creating us. Let us give him thanks because we are alive in a time as this. Because this is the time for the righteous to call up, to cry out, to shout, to plead for the kingdom of heaven to open up and answer, step into the course of this nation. I like us to pray this moment begin to ask the Lord that he will step into everything that concerns Nigeria everything that concerns this nation Nigeria beginning from the presidency to the state level even to the local government let the Lord step in to all that concerns this nation Nigeria let us ask the Lord to step into all that concerns this nation Nigeria in Jesus name we pray everywhere they are gathered against the destiny of this nation let we overturn their tables 
whatever table where they are deciding the backward movement of this nation nigeria begin to overturn that table begin to overturn that table every negative and satanic gathering that is not of the lord that is not designed by the king of heaven he said they shall gather but because i'm not in there in their midst that gathering is in futility he said they shall gather but it shall be in vain it shall be in vain begin to ask that the presence of the lord begin to scatter every utterance that is not of god every utterance that is not of the lord every declaration that is not of the lord whatever causes that may have been laid upon this nation begin to neutralize them begin to neutralize them begin to neutralize them every statement that says this nation shall not move forward begin to cancel it begin to cancel it begin to cancel it from the left to the right the north the south the east and the west wherever incantations may have been made against this nation nigeria we begin to uproot and bulldoze we begin to uproot and bulldoze and send him into the bottomless pit in the name of jesus christ begin to plead down the fire of the most high god everywhere they have written the name of this nation nigeria for backwardness and destruction we set that paper aflame we set it aflame we set it aflame in the name of jesus christ now say after me say my father my father say it like you mean it my father my father every pot and incantation every pot and incantation that has said this nation will not progress we overturn and scatter we overturn and scatter we overturn and scatter in the name of jesus christ we overturn and scatter we overturn and scatter in the name of jesus christ begin to rain down the presence and the power of the lord let he come from the north the south the east and west let us send our prayer armies and the prayer angels to the borders of this nation nigeria let us send the prayer armies and the prayer angels to the nation nigeria every border that has been opened up to indiscipline that has been opened up to corruption that has been opened up to terrorism that has been opened up to economic downturn we begin to close them now begin to close them begin to close them in the name of jesus christ we close them all we close them all we close them all in the name of jesus christ let us begin to plan the presence of god around the shores and the corners and the borders of this nation nigeria that whatever satanic vices that may have come in before they are now trapped begin to send them to the bottomless pit that this nation will become too hot it will become too hot for the kingdom of darkness whatever name they have declared against this nation and say this nation shall be a satanic nation a backward nation we overturn those plans we overturn those plans we overturn those plans in the name of jesus christ in the name of jesus christ in jesus name we pray let us move over now to the economy let us move now to the economy whatever may have been the covenant whatever they may have done with our currency whatever they may have done with our money that has made it difficult for this nation to progress this minute we cancel it we cancel it we cancel it in the name of jesus christ in the name of jesus christ now begin to call your family members your well wishers and your relatives using your business as a point of contact on behalf of my family begin to declare that i will as a point of contact that your business because you are from this country nigeria must progress in the name of jesus christ must progress in the name of jesus christ because you spring forth from this nation nigeria we use you as a point of contact we use your business as a point of contact we declare begin to grow begin to grow begin to expand begin to increase begin to increase in the name of jesus christ wherever the lord has sent you as a representative in this nation whether it's in the educational sector whether it's in politics whether it's in the healthcare, wherever the lord has sent you 
Let there be a revival and turn around. Let there be a revival and turn around. That wherever you shall go forth, that fire of revival, that fire of turn around, that fire of advancement, that fire of increase, that fire of breakthrough, it moves with you. It moves with you. Setting and destroying whatever garment of failure, whatever garment of disaster, whatever garment of backwardness that the enemy may have dropped on this nation we set them a place we set them a place we set them a place by the fire of the holy ghost by the fire which goes around with you by the fire which goes with you in the name of jesus christ by the power which is in the name of jesus christ we begin to lay a new foundation in the leadership of this nation we begin to lay a new foundation in the economy of this nation we begin to lay a new foundation in the educational sector we begin to lay a new foundation in the military and that foundation ladies and gentlemen is jesus christ jesus the author and the finisher the unmovable rock let Jesus come and dwell in this nation. Jesus, we hand this nation over to you. Jesus, we hand this country over to you. Politics, leadership, we cannot do it on our own. We hand it over all to you. In the name of Jesus Christ. Begin to invite the Lord Jesus Christ to take over every sector. Whatever sector that comes to your mind, begin to mention it. Jesus, take over. Jesus, take over. Jesus, take over. You see, brethren, we are not wrestling against flesh and blood, but against spiritual forces. We wrestle against spiritual vices. Wherever they are in gathering, Jesus sweep them away. Jesus sweeps them away. In the name of Jesus Christ. I use your family and your well wishers and your business as a point of contact this morning. There's a new uprising. There's a new beginning. There's a new transformation. There is change coming up. There is transformation coming up. Even those in politics and those at the corridors of power are confused. You will not be confused. Even though they are going backward, you will not go backward. When they are looking for people who are solution, they will find you. I say they will find you in the name of Jesus Christ. We see a new Nigeria coming forth. We see a new Nigeria coming forth. Thank you, Jesus. All the glory must be to the Lord. For He is worthy of a prayer. No man on earth should give glory to His All the glory must be to the Lord. In one minute, I want you to cry out to God. What is that family problem that you have? What is that sorrow? That is what is that pain that you have been crying before the Lord? This is the minute to cry out before the Lord. Mention that three things that is disturbing your heart. Those three things that are disturbing your heart that are giving you sleepless nights and pains. This is the time to cry out to the maker of the universe. This is the time to cry out. Father, we know you've heard us. We know you are able to do more than we can ask or imagine. For in Jesus' mighty name we have prayed. Amen. I want to encourage you to join in for the next uh, prayer by 6 p.m. this evening. And it's my belief that the Lord who answers by fire will intervene in your course in the name of Jesus Christ. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. <laughs>